Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me today. So today I'm going to be doing my breakfast meal prep for the week. I'm going to make a breakfast casserole. I love breakfast casseroles for meal prepping because it makes a big batch and I can portion it out into my portion sizes and have it ready for each morning and I don't have to worry about what's for breakfast. So I love making these, they're super easy. So for this week's breakfast casserole, it's gonna have eggs um, and heavy whipping cream. And then I'm gonna do some diced ham. This is like a thick sliced ham. I'm gonna have two different bell peppers. I have orange and green. And then I have shredded sharp cheddar cheese. So I'll have all this um, assembled into a Pyrex baking dish and I'll bake it in the oven. I have my oven preheating right now to 350 degrees. So this is really easy, uh, really healthy, nice keto breakfast meal for this week. Check the description box for the recipe if you wanna make this. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new here and click the bell button so that you get a notification each time I post a new video. Lots of meal prepping ideas for breakfast, lunch, snacks. I also have some new dessert recipes. So check all those out if you haven't already. And I will get this week's breakfast cooking. I have a thick sliced ham. Um, I really love this ham. I get it in the deli section. Um, it is much thicker than a regular deli meat, but um, I get this at my Walmart and it is really good, nice and thick. So I'm going to dice it into small pieces uh, for my breakfast casserole. I love making breakfast casseroles for a big crowd on the weekend for brunch, or these are really so perfect for meal prepping because it makes such a big batch and then I can just portion it out and have it ready for the whole week. So I have a whole bunch of diced ham and then I'm gonna use two peppers. So you can use your preference of color. I'm gonna use one green and one orange and I'm going to dice these up into small pieces about the same size as the ham. So I will dice both of these up and put them in the bowl with my ham. All right, so everything's diced. I'm going to use a half a cup of shredded cheddar cheese. This is actually a sharp cheddar cheese. I'm going to use one cup of heavy whipping cream, and then I will add in all of my eggs, and I'm gonna mix this all the way through so that I can put it in my casserole dish to bake up and make my breakfast casserole. All right, I'm going to spray my Pyrex baking dish really good with cooking spray so that my egg doesn't stick to it. Uh, so with all this cooking spray, it'll just pop right out, which is really great. 
So I am just gonna pour all of the mixture into the pan and it will just flatten out evenly. I'm going to bake this in the oven for about 45 minutes and then breakfast will be ready. All right, so the breakfast casserole is out of the oven. It is all ready to be portioned into my meal prep containers. Uh, these are the, from the same set that I use for my lunch meal prepping. Um, so I will link these, I just got them on Amazon. Really great glass containers for meal prepping. So check these out if you need to get some new ones. So I'm going to portion it out and breakfast is ready for the week. All right, so the breakfast casserole is all portioned out, ready to go. Super healthy breakfast, ready to go for each day this week. Check the description box for the recipe if you want to make this one really great for meal prepping, also really great for Sunday brunch or a big weekend breakfast if you're having people over. Uh, this is really great to assemble and just put in the oven and you don't have to worry about it. And then it's all done and ready for your guests. So I like to heat this up in the morning and put a little bit of avocado on top and it is delicious. So subscribe to my channel for more meal prep ideas and click the bell button so that you get a notification each time I post a new video. Thanks for watching today. I hope that you're having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.